An 18-year-old Saudi woman who rose to global prominence this week for barricading herself in a Bangkok airport hotel room rather than be sent back to her family arrived safely Saturday in her new home country of Canada. Rohaf Mohammed al Kunan, who was too tired to talk to the press after a long flight to Toronto from Bangkok through Seoul, South Korea, was greeted at the airport by Canada's foreign minister, Krista Freeland. It was Rohaf's uh, choice uh, to come out uh, and say hello to Canadians. She wanted Canadians to see that she's here, that she's well, and that she's very, very happy to be in her new home. Kunan was granted asylum in Canada on an appeal from the United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees. She fled her family and their alleged abuse a week ago, claiming her life would be in danger if she was forced to return to them in Saudi Arabia. She even refused to meet them in Bangkok, using Twitter to send a message for help after initially being denied entry into Thailand. My name is Rahaf uh, and I'm still in the room. Uh, I have no choice. Uh, they said I have to go tomorrow and uh, no one can help me right now. Her case has drawn attention to that country's strict social rules, including a requirement that women have the permission of a male guardian, usually a family member, to travel.